Hello viewers, this is IT System Admin, a complete troubleshooting solution for you. Today, in this tutorial, I am going to show you how to expand virtual disk in Hyper-V. Sometimes it becomes very important for you, so don't forget to watch full video. Look, this one is my Hyper-V virtual machine Windows 10 computer. Now minimize the virtual machine. Now right click on it and turn off the computer. Click on turn off. Right click on virtual machine and click on settings. Now click on virtual hard disk look the virtual hard disk name is win 10 and it located in d drive vm folder ok i am opening file explorer and this is d drive this is vm folder open it and look this is the Win 10 virtual hard disk and right click on it and click on properties look the size is 19.8 GB that means around 20 GB ok click on ok close file explorer now I need to expand this virtual hard disk to another 20 GB. Click on edit. And then click on next. You will find three, three options here. One compact, one another one is convert and another one is expand. The option expand this option expand the capacity of the virtual hard disk ok we need to select it and click next now the current size is 20 GB and new size is by default 21 GB ok I am going to select the new size 40 GB 40 GB ok that means double ok then click next and now click finish ok now click ok on virtual machine settings now I am going to start the virtual machine click right click on it and click on connect then Click on start. Click on connect. Okay, now I'm going to log in my virtual computer. Now click on view, click full screen mode. Okay, now right click on start menu, click on disk management. Look, I have got another 20 GB here and it's unallocated. The disk size is now. 40 GB. Now I am going to format this 20 GB. Okay, right click on this unallocated 20 GB and click on new simple volume and then next. Then the full size is showing here. 
I am not going to break this unallocated volume. Um, I only want to make a single volume from this 20 GB unallocated sizes. Okay, now click on next. Then the drive letter can be B or can be E. Okay, no problem. Now right click on it and uh, right click on it and the format will be NTFS and you can change the name if you want. I am not changing it right now. Okay, now click next and click finish. So this is the drive and close disk management. Close it now. Look, this is the B drive and this is C drive. You can use it right now as you want. This is all for today. Hope this tutorial is helpful for you. Keep watching for next tutorial. Thank you very much.